happy Thursday, everybody. Is today the 5th? If it is, happy freaking birthday to my cousin. Happy 30th birthday. Oh, and happy birthday to Anna, if she's out there watching. Okay, isn't my mug so cute? It's from Target. This is so rare. He always gets up out of bed, but today I'm going to have to get him up. Cannoli! I just want to crawl back under the covers with you. But I have to get you up. I have to make the bed and leave. P.S. Could not wear it. Lyrical smile indigo eyes hand on my thigh. We can follow the sparks. I'll drive. Chocolate and coffee at 6 a.m. is a great combo. Now I gotta go. Hey guys. Oops. Coming at you from lunch. Oh, have I showed you this? I don't think I have. Miss Lujan's closet, AKA it's my bathroom. I have two bathrooms in here, so I made one my storage slash bathroom. And of course, put the queen on the wall, the door. Um, Yeah, I have cute stuff in my classroom. I, I think so. We also have an elf for Elf on the Shelf, and I'm wearing a Santa hat, so we're very festive around here. It is the um, staff holiday party today after work, so we're all getting in the spirit, even though it's only the fifth, but you know, we can just keep the celebration going all month long. So it is now about 12.25, and the kids are out at 2.10, so the day's almost over. I'm gonna go eat my lunch. School's out, and if I didn't already tell you, tonight's the, I almost said the cast holiday party, wow. Blast from the past and shout out to Disney cast members. No, it's the company, company, teacher, work holiday party. So I'm gonna go to that, but first I'm stopping at Starbucks because it's a happy hour. And then I'm gonna go let Cannoli out and then off to the party. Hey guys, okay, so I just wanted to show you. I have showed you this life hack before but just in case you need a refresher, whenever Starbucks does happy hour, which is all, every Thursday during the month of December, you buy one, you get one for free. Just to prove that I do in fact have two. So, you know, one for me and uh, one for me. And then you have to have a bit of like delayed gratification. You can drink one now and save one for later, but like it's three p. I I mean like I don't necessarily need Okay, what I'm trying to say is that come morning time, I'm going to be hashtag blessed when I have these in my fridge, you know what I mean? And then, yeah, so you can either drink one now, save one for later, save both. You could get like a grande instead of a venti. These are just like iced quad espressos, which now that I'm thinking about it, is eight shots of espresso aggressive? Possibly. I drink a lot of coffee anyway, so I feel like I could handle it, but I don't know. All right, time to let the paparoo out and then get headed out. And here I am with freshly reapplied lip gloss and that Troutdale wind. What is it from the gorge? Hi, Tiff. Hey. But you know what? If my skirt flies, I can Oh, 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 oh. So we just left um, the party. It was great fun. I'll have to show you what it I got. So cute. I know. This whole store is cute. We're right by these, this like little outlet mall. So we just are popping in to the coach and <gasps> wherever else the wind, the wind literally blows us. Um, so I totally had the best white elephant gift and then it got stolen. So I'll have to show you what I was left with, but um, now I'm inside a coach, so I'm gonna go. But I just wanted to update you. Pause your convo. Pause my what? I said pause your convo. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, at oh, Bath and Body. Candle day is this Saturday, so they have all these ones out. This one's called Unicorn Sprinkles. It had fluffy cotton candy, rainbow candy, candy drops, and sugared lemon. And it smells exactly like the pink amoxicillin liquid that I used to take as a child. Holy cow. My mom used to have to hide this medicine from me. It smells good, but it definitely smells medicinal. 
And then this one is called Cereal Marshmallow Bar. Fruity Rainbow Cereal Sticky Marshmallow Fluff Confetti Sprinkles. Oh, that smells good. What did you just... <laughs> this smells good. Look at, look, look, look at mine. I'll put mine But I'm gonna wait till candle light. But it's nice to smell some of these like little obscure ones that they have out. Oh my gosh, this itches. <laughs> okay, we're now at a calendar store. Saturday, but hold on, I need to ask her. You guys are. And, and if you can do my hair sometime, by the way. If you can't, I yes. can do I mean, I can Hair and do it. table. I can do it. Hair and table. It needs to happen. Yeah. Um, I want these, you guys. I have officially become that freak. And here, I'm going to take it a step further and tell you that cannoli is cuter. This dog is precious, but cannoli is cuter. And then I'm going to show you that I really want to get him a long-haired sister, like, in the worst way. Or like that one. Oh, my gosh. Chihuahua life. I'm down on the floor, and I'm singing. <laughs> JK. But, okay, I believe that every person needs to own Monopoly. And I love how many themes of Monopoly there are. <coughs> and for all you 90s kids out there, like, I want this. Oh, the characters are Cynthia. Okay, wait, wait, wait. <clears throat> Cynthia, Phil and Lil's Ducky, Spike, Tommy's Screwdriver, Reptar, and Chucky's Glasses. Wow, this is amazing. From the floor, I can also see a Stranger Things one, which is cool. Deadpool, not my scene. Fortnite, not my scene. Riverdale, oh my gosh. Ow. It, Animaniacs, dude. And there's also a bunch of clues, like um, Scooby-Doo, Game of Thrones, Riverdale, Golden Girls. Wow. Okay, what are the pieces here? Oh, that's cute. But I feel like regrets, you know, really withstands the test of time. Ugh. Do you have Monopoly? Tiff? Yes. Yes, I do. Classic, or do you have a theme? Um. My heart, my hips, my body, my heart. I think we have a classic heart. one, but I, I, I think we have a theme one, but I can't remember. Oh, I want to look at the Stranger Things one. We have life. Ugh. Life's a fun one. They, they also have life themes over here. I have, um, what do I have? Harry Potter oh clue? No, I think I have like Haunted Mansion oh, clue. Wow. Something like that. Okay, let's look at this one. A giant slinky. Slinkies get so twisted up. Okay, giant slinky. Dude, I still want the Rugrats one out of all these. <gasps> Game of Thrones, I think this is on my Christmas list. Oh, yeah. Come to mama. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. Wow, I haven't heard this in forever. This is the one I want. Yup. Hi guys, I'm home now. Um, <clears throat> I'm about to like hop in the shower and such and put on my PJs. I already took off all my jewelry, but one of you was asking to see this sweatshirt on me. Um, so, I mean, you're in this stellar, like, bathroom light, but yeah, so this is a size double XL, it's, like, unwashed, um, today I am wearing jeans, and then I am wearing, like, a little, like, t-shirt underneath, but I also really like to wear double XL sweatshirts with leggings, and then if you want to pull, like, the whole Ariana Grande thing, which, like... When am I going to do that? Probably not really ever. You could. Um, I'm trying to show you. Like, it just barely covers my butt. But I also have a really, really, really long torso. So I'm not the best, like, judge of that. Because, yeah, I'm all, I'm five foot eight and I'm all torso. So for me, I don't plan on wearing it Ari style. I just plan on wearing it with, like, um, you know, leggings or jeans or whatever. If I did wear it Ari style, I would have to wear like little spandexy shorts underneath or, you know, tights also. But yeah, I'm gonna rinse off and 
I just wanted to show you that first. Okay, showered, changed, gonna have a little snack, I can't lie. And then I kind of bed. But, ow. I wanted to show you, I ordered something on Black Friday. <clears throat> if you know the influencer Alex Garza at all, um, she's best friends with Mallory Irvin, you might know her. I love both of them. And Alex and her husband Michael have this like online like t-shirt and sweatshirt boutique store where they, um, it's called Shop Good To Be. And I really love them and so like I love supporting and all that and I love me a graphic tee like freaking obviously. I went from the Taylor graphic to the this graphic. Um, but anyway, so but I've never really like loved anything enough to buy it. But there was one shirt that I remember like I really, really liked and I thought about ordering it, but then like I didn't, whatever, whatever. And oh gosh, one of the, um, sorry, I'm just being Monica over here noticing like a speck. Um, one of the things about their site is that their stuff is only available for like 72 hours and then it goes away forever basically. Like they have, you know, different like spring, summer, whatever, different launches and then Anyway, so the one shirt that I had like really, really considered getting came back for this like top 10 bestsellers of all time Black Friday collection. And so I ordered it. And so it came today. I must say I'm impressed with the shipping. Um, I feel like that was relatively quick. Let's see here. We have a cute, precious little card. It says, thank you. Whoa. There's some pictures of Alex modeling all the stuff. She is one of my, I'm going to sound so like lame here, but she is one of my top three like style icons. Okay. Icon might be a strong word, but inspiration, um, all of mine are like influencer people, but like that's the era we live in, right? Like that's their job. And so in terms of as far as influencers go and who is influencing me, um, I feel like style icon would be more like celebrities and things like that but the girls who put together all these cute outfits. It's Alex Garza. It is Amelia Liana, who is a like British YouTuber. And then um, Kathleen Barnes, otherwise known as Carrie Bradshaw lied. You didn't ask me for that, but I'm just being rambly per usual. So let me show you this shirt. I'm impressed with just like the cuteness of it all. Comes in like a nice protective little guy. This shirt feels nice and soft. I love that the label is printed in and it's their company name. And it's this cute little tan shirt that says nothing to wear. <gasps> cute. I'm excited. I dig it. So that's where I'm going to end this vlog. Thank you all for watching. Tomorrow is Friday. I don't really have any big riveting plans, but Fridays are always exciting. I will see you then. Let me know if you have any questions, comments, concerns, requests, etc. down below. Uh, yeah, love ya. Bye.